That's better. Okay, so we're sitting in the car park up at, where are we, Junction 1? Yep. And I've got Claire with me. And we went up to Claire's house. Well, what time is it now? It's about 4 o'clock or so. Yeah. Uh, went up to Claire's house about 1 o'clock. And Claire basically hasn't been in the shopping centre for a long, long time. Nope. And more. a year or more. So we've actually driven, driven, mm-hmm. driven, that's the word, <laughs> uh, up to the shopping centre here at Junction 1. And Claire is completely overwhelmed. Completely. She's sitting here. Just taking it all in. <laughs> in a car park that she has not been in. Uh, getting over her gate, getting over her front path has been a big issue for the last three years. Uh, but here we are. We're not going to leave the car just at the moment because you're completely overwhelmed. Yeah, I'm just... And she's completely exhausted from doing the process, the cam process that we had today. I'm just going to turn this sideways. Like <laughs> That's better. Why did you not say that earlier? So, Claire, from the cam process, how do you feel? Relief. Relief. So grateful. Okay, so before I came to, to work with you, uh, you have been in the house for almost three years, yeah. housebound. Mm-hmm. The farthest I got would be to the bottom of the road. Right. And you would have had massive anxieties then. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So uh, we're now out. We're probably about a mile away from the house. Yep. Into the biggest shopping centre. And how proud do you feel? I just, I have no words. No <laughs> words. No, word. no words. You're just, you can't believe it still. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I just, I don't know. I just, it's so overwhelmed. Well, very, very proud of you. Uh, you gave it everything. Remember I told you? You have to give me a hundred and I'll give yeah. you a hundred back. <laughs> yep. We're not going to do that analogy or anything, but you gave me a hundred. We got a hundred back. Got there in the end. And you're here. In the shopping centre, and there's a chance you're going out for dinner tonight with your yep. family. Yep. Wow. How does that feel? Well, just, I can't believe it. All right. It's just so much to take in. Okay, so Claire is overwhelmed. There's so much to take in, and really in the house, it was it was massive, yeah, wasn't it? It was. I had to do a house visit for this one because uh, Claire couldn't leave the house. So, massive, massive change. Uh, We're not going to take it any further just tonight. Uh, There's so much for Claire to take in. She is totally confused. She's bamboozled. She's sitting in shock, shock, actually, where she is at the moment. And she just can't believe it at the moment. So, I'm going to catch up with you on Thursday again. Yep. And guess what? Claire's coming down to the office in Larn to see me. Haven't been out of the house in three years, and you're going to come down to Larn to see me it's in the just office. Mad. Mad. Clean mad. Mad. But listen, you put the work in, and you've got your results. And I'm really proud of you for doing that. Okay, so this is, I'll send this down to you in a moment, Carl. So this is Claire, and uh, maybe when we get back up to the house, we'll maybe have a wee walk just. In her cold attack. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we'll do that. Yeah. Rather than the shopping centre. Yeah. This is this is just too big and unbelievable for you at the moment. Yeah, I just need to process this. <laughs> okay, so there's a lot to process. Uh, and believe me, there's a lot for Claire to process. Okay, I'll sign off now and I'll speak to you soon.